Mike Chi just released an experimental firmware for both the RetroTINK 4K CE and Pro that adds a new way to improve motion blur with higher refresh rates called MPRT BFI. Like other BFI methods, it helps improve motion clarity, however this one is very unique. It basically shifts all the brightness to the front of the sequence, allowing it to stay bright while still getting motion clarity improvements. The higher the refresh rate you output, the more options can be added, including adding a single black frame at the end for 240Hz output. Now let's take a look at a still shot of the sonic tree with no motion on screen, so you'll get an idea of the sharpest the tree could possibly look. Now really stare at this no BFI example, as this is actually an example of some of the least motion blur you'll see in 60Hz from a flat panel. Next are the existing BFI options, starting with CRT Beam Simulate, available only on the 4K Pro. Here's standard BFI available on both tinks and its dimmest but least motion blur setting. Now, finally, check out the MPRT BFI in 240Hz. You can see the reduced motion blur of the darkest BFI, but it's bright. And while the 120Hz MPRT isn't as good as 180 or 240Hz, it's still an option you should definitely try if your panel can handle the higher refresh rates.